I'm like, damn, I just spent $60 on stuffed animals. Hi guys, I am sitting on the floor of my dining room. Why? I just like the lighting in here. Anyways, let's go Halloween hunting. This is my first ever YouTube video, like full length one, other than like my embarrassing gymnastics videos when I was in like sixth grade. But anyways, keep it rolling. Um, yeah, we're gonna go Halloween hunting. I'm gonna start in all the areas around my house and then venture out if I'm not satisfied. And yeah. This being my first YouTube video, I'm very open to Chris to criticism so please let me know what you guys like and don't like for example i know this is a halloween hunting video but i'm gonna take you through my day a little too so you get the whole experience and let's go check out my goats this is the outfit since it's hot as balls outside i always go see the goats whenever i come and go from my house because they are like dogs and one they're so cute but two they love attention frank Usually they run right up when they see me at the gate, but they're napping, so I'm gonna go to them. I just gave them fresh bedding, so I think they're having fun in it. Frank is like, where's my food? All he wants is food and attention. He is definitely the most social of them. I don't know where he's going. And then that's Marla and Darla. This is the thing about the goats, is like they're too lazy to greet me, but if I leave, they get so upset. They come running over to the gate and they're so sad. And their little cries make me sad. So I feel guilty. So I end up hanging out here like all day. And Darla's peeing. Bye, guys. So I do have the doors off of my Jeep. So I won't be recording in the car just because it gets too loud. Halloween hunting, doors off in the warm weather. It's like I like summer, you know? My first stop will be Cracker Barrel because already been there, it's got great stuff and it's like literally two minutes from my house. Anyone's curious, I have the one touch top and I press a button and it rolls back. Let's go. First stop, Cracker Barrel. I just love how it's Completely my aesthetic in here. It's traditional Halloween with a lot of like vintage inspired Halloween items thrown in. So I came here when they first put out their Halloween decor and I have to say a lot of it has already sold out even the first day that they opened. And I know that sucks for a lot of people because most people start shopping in September. I'm not most people. But they also had Christmas stuff guys out which I guess we'll show at the end. But they added this Nightmare Before Christmas collection, which was new. I loved the Scooby-Doo stuff. And there it is, Christmas in July, Grinch, and um, Charlie Brown. Yeah, crazy. This is the earliest I've ever seen. As much as I love Halloween, sometimes I just can't justify the amount of money I spend on it. And especially being an adult and like having a house and like real life things, I'm like, Damn, I just spent $60 on stuffed animals. Oh well. Next stop, we're gonna hit Joanne Fabrics and Michaels because they're in the same plaza. I always forget that Joanne Fabrics is a fabric store, but they have so much stuff and I think they have some of the best stuff. I love that pumpkin skeleton man, but they have so many cute little trinkets and traditional Halloween decor. The floor mats, such a good dupe for Pottery Barn. Do you think it's time for some Starbucks camera guy? So I'm filming on my iPhone, but I stopped for a fall drink and I did a grande nitro cold brew. Guys, if you get nitro, I forgot to ask for ice. Make sure you ask for ice. Um, two pumps of brown sugar syrup, one pump of toffee nut, one pump of cinnamon dolce, and caramel drizzle. drizzle. Did I say the two pumps of brown sugar? Anyway, delicious. Tastes like fall in a cup and it's the next best thing to pumpkin because you can't get that anywhere right now. Last stop today is Michael's, and honestly, they didn't have that much, just a bunch of the Halloween villages, but they were really cute. Anyways, I cannot believe how empty Michael's was. Everyone else's, when they post on TikTok, their Michael's is loaded with Halloween stuff, 
all they had were like the the haunted houses the little villages but joanne's had some really good stuff guys i'm just editing right now as you can see and um i realized i forgot to record an outro but i just want to say thank you guys for watching my first video let me know in the comments what you want to see next bye <laughs>